know the name of the man arrested in connection with a violent crime spree in Rockford and the surrounding area. Yeah, it ended with four people dead, seven others seriously hurt. CBS News' Mugo Adikwe is live in the newsroom with what we've learned so far. Mugo. Yeah, good morning to you both. The suspect has now been identified as 22-year-old Christian Ivan Soto, and he is expected in court later this afternoon. Here he is on your screen. Police released this mugshot just this morning. They confirmed Soto is facing several charges, including murder, intent to kill, and home invasion with a dangerous weapon. Now, four people were killed in the violent crime spree. They range in age from 15 to 63. Seven others were seriously injured. The attacks happened at several locations around the Rockford area. According to authorities, a crime spree started around 1:15 yesterday afternoon as a home invasion. A woman was injured during a stabbing along with a good Samaritan who tried to help her. The whole thing ended with the suspect in police custody around 1:35. Investigators confirmed a postal service worker is among those killed. A woman who lives in the area tells us it was her longtime mailman. Witnesses say he may have been hit by this pickup you see here mail carrier. He is the kindest person. He would help anybody. He would step in and help. Always friendly. We will miss him. I think like most Rock 40 is just totally shaken by uh, this act of violence and the impact that it's having now on multiple families lives. Now, to be clear, police say not all of the 11 victims in the attack were stabbed and none of them were shot. A news conference is planned for 1130 this morning. Soto, the suspect in this case, is expected in court at 130. Right now, it's still not clear why he did this or if he knew any of the victims. A vigil is planned for later this afternoon in Rockford. The city is also offering emotional support and counseling for those who live in the neighborhood where the attacks happened. We're live in the newsroom. Mugodigwe, CBS. News. Mugo, thank